So I was telling Maddie that um, Hildegard is um, from the year 1100. And this is her cookie recipe because with all the trials that were going on then, as well as now, people needed joy. And so Hildegard created this recipe and called it Cookies of Joy. And I've had Maddie bring down her favorite book of women who persisted. I like that word. Because those are influential women in today's world. And they're, they're women who made a difference because they believed in themselves and they believed in their message. Well, Hildegard, she also was a woman who had a message and she believed in herself. She was a nun in the Catholic Church. All of us have gifts and everybody's gift is different. Well, Hildegard apparently had the gift of receiving messages from God, messages that God wanted all of God's people to know. And it took her 40 years, but she, she found her voice and she became immensely influential in the Catholic Church in her time, so much so that popes and bishops <laughs> so she became so influential that popes and, and bishops listened to her and sought her counsel because she had what we might call the ear of God in her life. Now, there's a lot of people who have had that kind of a relationship with God and the church took these people who had this special relationship with God and announced them as saints in the church. And so that's what we're celebrating here, the Feast of All the Saints and Hildegard, who I like the title of that book over there. This is for the big people. Prophet of the Cosmic Christ. Now, what are we going to do to push these down flat? <laughs>